Hey, what's up, bro? Welcome back to Demon's Souls. So last time, we made our way through the Shrine of Storms and took on the Adjudicator. Gino was fat fellow with like a butcher's knife sticking out of his stomach, which turned out to be a weak point, which made him fall down so he could beat up the seagull on his head to kill him. Makes perfect sense to me. Also, when I was editing the last video, I noticed there was actually a couple of things that we didn't find or areas that I completely missed uh, back before the Adjudicator. For example, I don't think we actually went out in this direction. I mean, we passed it, but... Don't think we ever went over here. Nope, this booty. Confirmed it is new. Okay, so what the hell is going on up here? What? You scary give Sparky me. Give Twinkly me. Me. You trade. Trade. Give me Sparky Twinkly. Creepy. <laughs> Very creepy. Okay, so I'm guessing we found this game's version of the random crows that you can trade items to. Don't know where you have to drop them. I assume maybe where this guy's message is. That might be like a... Like a guide or something? I don't know. So, yeah. Apparently we can trade with this guy. I don't know what we're actually supposed to give him or her. It's probably her, let's be honest here. So, I'm gonna look it up very quickly, see what things we can trade, and we'll try doing that. So, give me a moment here. Okay, I looked it up, and apparently one of the items we can trade is the Talisman of God that I do believe we found very recently. I think it was even in this world, so... Yeah, I'm assuming that's some kind of mage thing, so we probably don't need that, so we're just gonna drop that and try and trade it. Sparkly! Happy! Happy! <laughs> well, isn't that lovely? We've made the creepy bird happy. Okay, I'm gonna log out back in, and we'll see if it's actually worked. Okay, we're back and I'm kind of concerned because my item's gone, but I don't see anything in return. Okay, it's there. Thank you. And there we go, we get a colorless demon soul. And <laughs> shut up! I already what traded with you. Give... Get out of here, Please. you scumbag. But uh, yeah, I do believe the colorless demon soul can actually be used to reinforce the dragon bone smasher, so... Finally, we can actually upgrade that weapon. I think we have to take it to Blacksmith Ed back in Stonefang Tunnel, so... We'll do that when we're done here, not really any rush right now. But, uh, yeah, I believe there was another pathway that we didn't actually go down, so I'm gonna try and find that, but I don't remember exactly where the hell it is, so... Give me a moment here. Okay, this looks new to me. i pretty damn sure- Oh, hello, buddy. Holy shit! Yeah, I'm pretty damn sure I saw this pathway, because it's at the bottom of one of the towers that we dropped down. But I think I just assumed that it was leading us straight back to the beginning, where we killed the Vanguard, because it looked very similar out here, but... Nope, we most definitely haven't been here, and you, sir, you'll get out of here. Are you alive? Yes, you are. And now you're nuts. Okay, and we got some booty. Really more soul remnants? I don't need the mass too many. Oh, why not? Just give me six more. Sons of bitches. Okay, we got some booty. Hey, I actually know what this is. This leads us right back to the beginning. And we got a Crescent Falchion plus one. Cool. I'm assuming that's probably going to be kind of good. It's got, uh, yeah, it seems to have scaling in either intelligence or faith. Don't know which one that is, but... We ain't a sorcerer, nor are we a miracle person, so not really going to be any use to us, I would assume. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's about all we missed for now, so screw it, let's carry on. Archstone of the Demon Adjudicator. The dead, given seals of the hero by the Adjudicator, are taken to the Shadowman's Shrine to be purified and mourned in the storm. Well, ain't that lovely. I'm guessing this area is going to be a lot tougher than the last one, but maybe I'll be wrong. I guess we'll see. Okay, let's go. And yes, I probably should have gone and upgraded the Dragon Boner before we came here. Why didn't I? Mostly just out of pure laziness, because I didn't want to go through like 10 load screens to go and do that shit. And mostly we're using the longsword anyway, so I'm hoping it's not really going to matter, but... If I feel like we need to do it, then we'll go do it, but... Yeah, for now, laziness kind of prevailed. And I saw some booty over on the left. Is there some over here? Yes, there is. Pretty damn sure I saw a Stingray as well, which is kind of concerning to me, because... Those dudes are dicks. I'm hoping we don't really have to deal with them here, but it really wouldn't surprise me. Right, some more loot around here. I don't know if it's safe to walk around the edge, but I guess it kind of has to be. So you can get back again, unless there's a way to go over here. No. Okay, don't kill me, game. Oh, thank you. Okay, I think we came from above. Yes, we did, because there's booty down here. And I am pretty damn sure, yeah, it's an NPC. Wait a minute, is that Patches? Are you Patches? I, I can't tell. You all look alike. Hello there. We meet again. You look terrible. Cheer up. Life is an adventure. <laughs> Steady on there, Monty Python. Oh, it's Grave Robber Blash. 
isn't this the guy that we saved from the cell at the beginning of this world? I'm glad I saved you now so that you could freaking get out and then tell me that I look terrible. You're a dick, sir. An absolute dick. He's got shards of dark stone and shards of cloud stone. Okay, I'm guessing that's some kind of magical material that we probably don't really need for what we're doing here, but maybe I'm wrong about that. He's got a falchion and scimitar. Kind of tempted to buy them because they're very cheap and we don't... Yeah, yeah screw it, we'll buy each one just in case. I get the feeling they're more going to be dex weapons than strength, but that'll do. Kai also tempted to buy grass, but I don't think we really need it right now. There's somebody I ought to warn you about. A fellow who lacks common decency. They call him Patches the Hyena. And he's the one that laid that trap for me. He's the kind of person who'd stab his mother in the back. If you happen to spot him, you'll be doing us all a favor by putting him out of his misery. Oh, trust me, buddy. It's tempting. Have you been to the altar where sorcerers summon shadows? Yeah. Well, I think someone may be trapped in the lower cavity. I heard them praying for dear life. Pity the poor fool. He probably fell for one of Patchy's old tricks. I do not trust you, sir, at all. Pity the poor fool. He probably fell for one of Patchy's old tricks. All done. Good day. Be sure not to get yourself killed. Okay, I'm calling it now. This guy's a bad guy and he's gonna be in cahoots with Patches. Maybe it's because they're both bored that I don't trust them, but, uh, yeah, I feel like they're working together to try and kill me. Oh, it's the Grim Reaper. Well, ain't that lovely. Well, I'm guessing that's the sorcerer summoning people that uh, the fellow was mentioning, and there's a weird-looking ghost thing over there. And there's also a regular ghost buddy just to confuse my brain even more. Well, fan freaking tastic. And what looks to be prism stones down below. Oh god, what the hell are you doing? Okay, I killed it. Surprisingly easy. Also gave me a bunch of souls considering that, so I'm guessing they probably hurt like hell. Don't hit me. Do not freaking hit me. I'm guessing if we fall down here, it's probably gonna be insta-death, but... Yeah, that's where the sorcerer was, so maybe we could just drop down there and get to him quickly. I don't really know, but I also don't want to try it just in case. So yeah, we're just gonna try taking the long way down. And you get out of here. Perfect. Anything I can do with these? No. And oh, da, 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 da. I saw there was some booty in the other direction, but I kind of want to deal with these dudes first. And they seem to keep coming back, so... Yeah, I'm gonna assume we have to kill the sorcerer, and then maybe they'll stop. Or maybe they'll never stop. I don't know. But why are these messages everywhere? Like, I'm in trouble, please. You're not in trouble. Yes. What is wrong with people? It's like, oh god, it's like the humanity thing in the first game. Like, oh Jesus. Okay, you don't do that much damage. That's uh, that's a good thing. But yeah, it's it's like the whole humanity thing in the first game. Like everyone begging for humanity all the damn time. It's like, stop wasting the humanity the game gives you, and you won't need to ask for it all the time. Like, I don't get it, man. I just don't get it. And a shit ton of them just spawned. That's not good. Okay, he's up here. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of these dudes first, just in case they beat me up whilst I'm trying to kill this guy, because I'm guessing he's gonna be tough as shit. And that... Okay, maybe he's not. And that was very close to hitting me. We got some grass. Oh, God, they're still here. Hey, it actually disappeared. Yes, it worked. Okay, so I was thinking that was like a boss or something, but apparently not. Well, don't that look ominous as all hell? Can we go in here? now? Again, there might be one of those weird places where there's not actually any rubble if you're in white or black world tendency. I'm purely guessing here, I have no idea. And found some booty in like a weird shiny puddle. Well, alright then. Okay, so before we go through that ginormous door over here, let's check around the area to make sure there's nothing we're missing, because there's bound to be some booty and stuff. For example, I saw some hanging over the edge that we can't really get. So I'm guessing we have to go around the back of that. Is that a prism stone? Yes. Okay. And... Is that Patches? I guess it makes sense, he didn't mention him. Oh, hello again! Word. Hey, don't turn a cold shoulder. I didn't mean to do you wrong. Really? Come on now! We've got better things to fret about! That pit there is filled with treasure. But, uh... I can't get to it myself. Go on. 
Have a look. It's more riches than I've ever dreamed of. It'll shimmer you blind. Yeah, I'll bet, buddy, I'll bet. What's keeping you? Have a look at that treasure down in the pit. Then we'll work out a way to fish it out. <laughs> oh, Patches, you scallywag. Have a look at that treasure. Okay, thing. okay, so I'm guessing this is gonna go exactly the same way as it does in Dark Souls 1, where he's just gonna boot me up the arse when I go too close to the Pit of Doom, sir. Before we go and do that, because we are gonna do that. Because I'm assuming it's not gonna kill us, but you never know, maybe it will. But, uh, yeah, I wanna check around here and make sure we're not missing any booty or anything, because it just looks like these staircases at the side just lead back up to the top, sir. I don't actually know how you get to the loot, because we did see loot around here, but I don't know how to do it. Yep, what a dick. <laughs> Don't hold it against me, eh? Take your time starving to death. Then I'll sell every last trinket off your corpse. <laughs> Patches, I both love you and hate you, and there seems to be a fella over there, and... Okay. This is weird. Why is there, like, one white dude on the other side and one red dude on the other side? Are you aggressive? Yes, you damn well are, and no, I'm not surprised about this. Wait, how did I just do damage to that guy? I swear I just did damage to him. Oh, God! Okay, I'm trying to parry with my hand here. This is not working. This is not working at all, and you seem to do a butt-ton of damage. Okay, we go off the grass. Ouch! Oh, shit! Okay, I don't want to die here. That, that would really suck. Buddy, leave me alone. No, 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 no. It's a very bad red phantom. Ouch! Okay, does he take damage? Yes, he does. Not quite enough, though. We need one more shot. And there we go. Get out of here. That was the worst parrying of all time, but the point is we didn't die. What do you drop? Hey, you do actually drop something. A chunk of Dark Moon Stone and some of the eye thingies. Ascending stairs. See, this is the, the fatal flaw in all the patches' plans. It's like, it's really easy to escape every goddamn time. Assuming that door's not locked, and if it is, that's gonna suck. I also don't know how we get to that loot up there. I probably have to drop on it from above, I would imagine. Are you friendly? I guess you are. Good. Okay, who are you? Oh, it's you. Did you cleanse the world of another dark soul today? You mean the right guy? God has chosen you, and for that we are thankful. Umbasa. Umbasa. <laughs> God has chosen you. Really? That's Umbasa. all you gotta say? You don't sell anything? You don't do like any God spell um training or anything? No? You're just a random religious man in a pit of doom that basically thanked me for killing the red guy on the other side of the room from him. <laughs> well, alright then. Well, yeah, I guess we're going back to patches. I have no idea where the hell this is gonna take us out. Like, I, I don't know. But, uh, huh. They all look very suspicious to me, but no, apparently not. But yeah, I remember people mentioning there were illusory wars in World 4. We found some already, but there may still be more in this section. I have no idea. Oh, we found a hidden door. Oh, it's right behind Patches. <laughs> Surprise, bitch. Remember me? You, you. Hey, look, I'm really sorry. I didn't mean what I said. Well, I mean, a man's got to make a living, right? True. Here, look. I can make up for it. There aren't many humans like us. We need to stick together. I know. Here, take this as a token of my friendship. You've seen one of these before, surely? I don't know, maybe you should just give the damn thing to me. <laughs> yes, I have. <laughs> Come on! Let's be friends! What do you say? No need to drag each other down. Can we hold hands in a circle with a religious man in the pit and sing Kumbaya? No need to drag each other. I guess not then. Okay, so... You just twitch then. Don't be doing that, Patches. Right, so I'm gonna try and drop on this thing, but it... Yeah, it looks like it's not at the right angle. I don't know how the hell we do that. But anyway, so, uh... What the hell was I gonna say? Yeah, it... Obviously, we have the option to kill Patches, like you could do to any NPC. And trust me, I'm very tempted to kill the guy. But at the same time... It's gonna get rid of his storyline. Like, I wanna see how many times he's gonna pop up and try and kill me and shit, so... That's why I'm not gonna kill him. I'm sure at some point we will murder him, maybe before we end the game. And we are standing on a bunch of dead, uh, Stingray Mentoray thingies. Well, uh, 
Right then, this is creepy and also leads me to believe we are probably gonna run into a bunch of them. Yep, there's one over there right now. Well, <laughs> shit. It was nice while it lasted, that's all I'm saying. Oh, bunch of skeleton buddies down there, so I'm guessing that's what we're gonna be luring out. Can I do anything with this flag? I don't know why, I just feel like... No, I guess not. I thought maybe we could cut it, but no. Okay, let's go kick some skeleton ass. Luckily, we have the thief ring, so I'm guessing we can probably lure them out one at a time. Kinda like that. Perfect. Not perfect, that guy shoot him. <laughs> Dick! You've ruined everything. Okay. So you're an archer, the other guy doesn't seem to be, so we're gonna try and bum rush the archer. It's not working. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Run. Just run. We need to get some goddamn distance and eat our grass. Gil, Gil. What? R what? <laughs> you killed me? Damn, son, those things are quick. Well, that sucked. Hold up, whilst we're here, do you have anything new to say? Oh, hello. Uh, this is where the ancient barbarians offered their honored heroes to the winds. To seek winds in life and meet winds in death. That was the warrior's code. That's beautiful. All that's left here now is a fine pile of dust. I have never been so wrong about a dig. I've disgraced the blige line of grave robbers. Yes. Yes, you have. I have never been so wrong. Hmm. Well, suit yourself. But a bit of indulgence goes a long way. Bro, I just died. I don't have my freaking souls. Also, I'm getting... Yeah, these things are back again. Yeah, I... Oh, God. Okay, I probably don't want to drop down here. <laughs> I was hanging right over the edge there. Yeah, the uh, sorcerer fella's over here, so I'm guessing... Yes, he's back again. Now, can we drop down here safely? Yes, we can, and we even hit him on the way down. Suck on that. Okay, that takes care of that. Thank you, and we got some more booty. Perfect. It's kind of annoying that we're gonna have to kill that guy every time I die, but... The easiest solution to that problem really is, hey, motherfucker, stop dying. So, that's what we're gonna try and do here. We know this time that uh, Rolly McGee over there is going to be dangerous as bull, so we got to take out this guy, then again, we got to try and bum rush the archer, but we got to try and do a better... Oh, God! Jesus, man! We got to try and do a better job than we did last time, because last time I got stuck on Rolly McGee, and yeah, kind of beat the shit out of me. Kill me a body. There we go. Now get out of my way. Get out of my way. And it's your turn. Duh! Perfect. Now, come here, you son of a bitch. Okay! Taken care of. That was much better. What the hell is that? That's a dude's arrow. It's kind of cool. Oh, great blood. That's always a good sign. I see loot over there, and I just saw a gold skeleton with a ginormous sword. Yeah, I see you there. Oh, shit, there's two of them. And I aggroed them both. Oops. I may have kind of screwed up there. As a fog wall, but I think we should take care of these dudes. Plus, I want the loot, so. Oh, God. Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn it, I thought I was dead so I didn't move. Oh, that sucked. Okay, we're back again. This time, this time it's personal. I have the giant dragon boner of justice, and God, are you gonna taste it. Yeah, suck on that, you sons of bitches. This thing seems way better for dealing with those guys. But yeah, the long sword seems better for the other ones. And I almost forgot to go and grab this loot over here. A storied soldier soul. Cool. I'm glad the damn stingrays aren't shooting me out here, because if they did on top of everything else, this would be a really dickish section. But it would be kind of cool at the same time. Get some more booty down here, and we appear to be going into a ginormous cave of death. That's always lovely. I see some more loot over there. Oh, great! Pits of doom are freaking everywhere. What the hell is that? I don't know what that is. This place is humongous, and I almost missed this as well. Full moon grass. Handy. Very, very handy. And some loot over here, and I'm pretty damn sure there's gonna be an enemy behind me, so... Yes, there is. Why is your face going purple? Oh, God! I think we know why his face is going purple now! Holy shit! Duh! Oh, God, that was a hell of a kill. Really? 800 souls? Damn! Dude, it looks like an enemy's down there, so we can probably go all the way to the bottom. And yeah, I have to use bow. I don't have a bow. Screw you! Oh, hello. When did you come from? Oh, God, oh, God, what are you doing? Okay. Don't do that. But yeah, I have to get myself into the mindset that enemies always respawn, except, you know, if it's a mini boss or something, because I'm in, like, the Dark Souls 2 mindset of, like, well, you know, this might be a good place to farm, but eventually they're gonna... Oh, God! Eventually they're gonna stop spawning, but it's not the case in this game. 
I really dislike the whole despawning system of Dark Souls 2. I mean, like, yeah, you can aesthetic things, but then you make the area way tougher. It's, I don't know, it's just kind of annoying as hell, so. Yeah, what the, what the hell? What just happened? I, I, oh god, the Grim Reaper, get out of here. Okay, I think it's dead. Holy shit. Oh god, what's going on? Oh, god. What is that thing? It's like a little version. Did it backstab me? What the hell just happened here? I'm so confused right now. That scared the shit out of me. And that sign said behind you, thanks buddy. Thanks. You know why I got backstabbed by that thing? Because I was reading your freaking sign. It's not helpful. <laughs> My god. Okay, so note to self, there is apparently smaller versions of them which I think came out of the ground. And backstabs you for a shit ton of damage. Like, holy hell, that really scared the shit out of me. I didn't know what the hell was going on there. Okay, and we got some Chrism What the? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> really, there's another one? Oh, shit, just keep rolling. Keep rolling like Fred Dust. Oh, my God. Okay, I think there was two of them. Yes. What the hell? Ouch! What the hell was that shit? Did I kill them both in the same swing? I... Uh, I think I did. I really hope so. Oh my god, man. This area sucks. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me twice. Oh, thank you, God, we're outside. Just pepper me with stingray stinger thingies. I don't care. I'd rather die to them. I really would. All the giant skeletons of death. That that place was terrible. That was like that was like a horror game in there. That really was. Seriously, man, why does every message say, <laughs> every message, I'm in trouble. Please recommend No. Get out of here, scumbags. Do it like a man. Okay, where the hell are we now? We're back inside again. I, oh god. Oh god. I don't, I don't want to be back inside. There's probably more of those little ground monsters. I don't want to get backstabbed by them again. I also don't really want to stop. Oh god, it's one of the purple face ones. I also don't want to stop in case one of them just randomly. Oh shit. Ouch. God damn that hurt. Oh shit, the Grim Reaper's next to me. Okay, we got out of the way. Oh, not good. Not good. Not good. Block it. Still did a ton of freaking damage! Damn! <laughs> the Grim Reaper just booked me in the face! Oh, son of a bitch, I gotta go all the way back again. Oh my god. Okay, we're back, and my souls are right here. We're gonna grab the- No, 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 I try to grab the souls. Oh, shit. Okay, you need to die, sir. Okay, it's gonna meet the other guy to spawn, so we're gonna go down here. Please don't be anything to backstab me that randomly pops out of the ground. Okay. Grab the souls. Thank you. And give me that booty. Get- Give me the- Thank you. Okay. Looks like we can't go down there. That makes me happy. We're just gonna keep going, and good lord. This- This place is terrible. This is the hardest section of the game for me personally so far. Holy shit. Really cool area though, I do like it. It reminds me a little bit of the Tomb of the Giants, but... Also kind of different. I don't really know how to explain it, but... Uh, it's got a little bit of a sort of Catacombs Tomb of the Giants vibe. Beware of the light ahead. Oh. Well. <laughs> this looks like a giant room of death, so I'm gonna end it here next time. We go in there, probably die, and hopefully take on a boss. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, it was appreciate a like, and I will see you next time for more Demon Souls.